Hello there everyone and welcome back. This is Ustashi and last time we managed to find this second beacon in uh, the Royal Garden. And uh, we did some upgrading of ourselves. As you can see I also now have a scythe and uh, so I have a secondary plague weapon. Let's see here what, uh, what these Royal Gardens are offering to us. I will be collecting some more, some more side uh, shards here. No, that that health that one brings back. It's actually not bad. So I tried that just now. And apparently, oh, that's another one well, of those researchers. Apparently, you don't. You can also finish them off with a supercharged attack. Hmm. I did not know that. So let me just try to carefully do this one by one. slower, I like that. I like quite a bit. Wow. That was that was great. So you have something that's called a blood weapon, huh? Okay, so the scythe does have a short range there. Oof, wrong time on my part. Mm. Are you healing or what? Did I interrupt my healing there? Ah, the activation is also slower. Oh, you can shoot, huh? There we go. Let me get your blood weapon there. And the alchemy enhancer, that's also very lovely. The blood blade. I haven't tried that one yet. Folk Potions Research Report 1. After Hermes Kingdom began its alchemy research, folk medicinal concoctions uh, began to appear in great numbers. The majority are nonsensical, but a small minority of the formulas, after experimental testing, have been shown to be surprisingly effective. For example, mixing rosemary, thyme, and mixing rosemary, thyme, and something. So we did pick up rosemary before, so I didn't check that yet with my potion. I'll do that later if I remember. Is this a stronger one? You seem to have a saw. Ah, uh, you're one of those, huh? Oh, that. Oh, yeah. I remember. That does uh, increase saber damage. Mm -hmm. 
I remember that one. Oof. Yeah, I'm not sure if this uh, slow potion is working for me actually. Um, I will go back to my normal potion. General potion, I think it was called. And I will. Can I upgrade it? No, I need more. So I will definitely equip this one again and craft. Increase damage by one. The one percent is really, really not interesting. Health recovery. That is interesting. Rosemary. And the sage damage by. 3% that's it's actually already better but I will go for the maximum extra health increase or well, actually wait a minute wait a minute wait, 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 wait. if I go for long lasting potion and it already says plus 90 so no it so what I was thinking maybe it increases Yeah, no, it just makes the health recovery stronger. Um, plus 108. Maybe that is better. It's just slower to activate also. The general potion is very quick to activate. So I'll put you there and I will put the big one here, Sage, plus 72. And the um, last one is the fast action portion. Probably more like in Bloodborne. Okay, so we can upgrade this one. And I can upgrade the Blood. Sword. I'm not really interested in blood sword actually. Not this time. Do I want this one though? <coughs> no, I'm going for strength and plague, so let's stick with that. Did I now equip the right potion? I think so. Wait, this is not where I need to be, I think. Action going. Uh, no, I need to go there, I think. Yeah. Bye. So. This was the room. I do like the sides quite a bit actually. Yep. Ah, shouldn't spam so much. There we go. Because with the sides I can open like this, then I can Maybe finish you off actually. There we go. It's almost like um, these plague weapons are actually their spirits in a way. Or maybe the plague, but it does make sense because the plague is kind of what keeps them alive. Yeah, this one activates way quicker. Mm -hmm. Oof, two 
to later. These are so tough, man. Let's go with, let's go with the Albert for the reach. This session I need a little break because it's uh, very intense on the concentration and I'm not any kind of pro gamer so <laughs> I do need my I do need my rest in between Actually, hmm, boy, 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 boy. Okay, let's try again here. Hey, Lifty. Okay, let's try again. Luckily, it's not so far away. Thanks, Leafy. Okay, so then now we can take down this one. And then this one. Thank you. 
go in. Once in a row, I was just too late there. Okay, let's try again. <sighs> I think those are the toughest enemies so far for me. Um, is this the right, right direction? Wait, I'm so confused. Here, maybe we didn't even go there yet. Got everybody. Wow. Hmm, that, that didn't work. Okay. shield I cannot uh, steal the plague weapon and soul basically right with no hmm. so you are guarding this area this crystal I wonder what that what that means Thank you very much. And the guitar. Let's take a look here. Mint. You were guarding mint. Hmm. <coughs> what does mint do? Potion ingredient it has a disinfectant, antibacterial, insect repellent, refreshing and fatigue relieving effect, energy recovery it gives. Okay, that is interesting. Okay, so this side took some time to get through it, but I managed to do it. Uh, let's go check the other side then. Actually, let's first... Wait. Is it closed off? Oh, here. First heal you up. And uh, maybe increase one of the potions, yeah. Can upgrade this one for its health recovery or additional 
Okay, yes, slot, I think I will go for that. And then this one I will craft. And... Rosemary... Increases damage? Nope. Health recovery plus 60. Yeah, let's just go for that. Because I notice they don't fully heal me up anymore. Just flat out healing me up sounds good to me. Then left we have done. So now let's check here. There's a note there. And a stronger individual here. Oh, you have Albert. That's nice. Oh, you are a strong one. Okay. that wrong, I guess. Okay. <laughs> um, let's get back to it immediately. Get totally destroyed by that um, by that individual over there. I do need some reach here. The scythe has a very short reach, so maybe I will exchange it for something else. That's what I wanted to do all along. Okay, buddy. Let's go. Oh, let's <laughs> just charge each other. Let's go. <laughs> there we go. Give me a Albert. And an alchemy enhancer. And some lavender. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. Thank you very much. Uh, let's check over here. What is this? Nothing. Oh, is this an elevator? Wait a minute. It is an elevator, but it doesn't seem to be working. This doesn't show any way of interacting with it. Alchemy Researcher's Notebook 2. The, illeg uh, the illegible handwriting is difficult to decipher. Injecting a tiny amount of vile blood into an organism will have any effect, will not have any effect on its vital functions. But if a certain amount is exceeded, the effects will be nearly impossible to control. Okay. That is interesting. So it either does basically nothing or everything, if you exceed a certain threshold, that is interesting. I really need to time this, uh, oh, yeah. Yep. I wanted to, uh, practice my deflections, but then I remembered, like, hey, I might as well heal up a little bit. It's not a big one. This one is, this one is not that... Uh, not a special one. I'm sure mommy thinks you're special, but, you know. show us these doors that cannot really be opened. They just show a fence, right? 
It kind of gives me the wrong impression. Careful. Alright. So I got this time here. Might as well use it. Do quite a bit of uh, plague damage now, which is really nice. <clears throat> okay, what is this? Greenhouse proc Procurement Order. In response to the new experiment, Central Authority calls for the swift procurement of the following items. Stone Tortoise, Driven Eagle, Passenger Pigeon, Mountain Tiger. However, please be aware that the epidemic is still rampant, so all relevant tests must be conducted in full. So this gives me the impression that I did some experimentations with different animal parts, and I'm expecting some kind of... Like, what are those creatures, mythical creatures called again? Some kind of creature that has parts of uh, each of them. That's what I'm kind of expecting and reading from this. The healing of the site is real nice though, like that. So I might as well keep it for now. This potion healing is limited, so that does help me out here quite a bit. Alchemy Researcher's Notebook 1. And again, this is difficult to decipher because of the handwriting. Take the blood of the infected as raw material. Perform the following steps. After removing the vile blood, what remains is pure blood. Beware. Vile blood is highly contagious, and any biological organism that comes into contact with it has the possibility of infection and mutation. Yeah, I guess that's much. So that's basically what happened. It was already pretty clear. There's, oh, that's a lot of blood here. Whoa. That's a lot of blood. This whole area is covered in blood. Okay. Literally a layer of blood that we're standing in here to the, in the library. So I think... Okay, that's a new enemy type. They just disappear. Hmm. Like blood demons or something? Plague? Manifestations. Hmm, interesting. <clears throat> Introduction to Alchemy. A water-soaked book with only a few recognizable words remaining. Alchemy is the area of science that researches the nature of objects. All things can be divided into smaller units until they can no longer be divided. These basic units may contain properties that are completely different from their source. Alright. So I'm expecting in this library some kind of boss fight and the uh, look around here a little bit. Definitely the blood is connected to that structure there. Why are the cages though in the library? That was hanging cages, tree. Oh yeah, of course they were doing experimentation on living organisms there for the cages. So far, I've not. Oh, whoa, whoa, what's what's? I've not been letting these things attack me. There, something bigger shooting at me. Need to be get close to you, huh? Okay. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, he got me good there. Beautiful. That was a cool move. Luckily, you don't have any pores, so that's good for me. Ah, wasted that one. Take whatever you have there. A whip. Okay. That's very interesting. You were guarding this. Some memories, huh? Collection of memories. That was a very exciting fight. And you dropped a whip. Okay. Alchemy Researchers Notebook 3. Strange phenomena occur when vile blood and pure blood are injected into an organism at the same time. Mm. Crystallization and a drastic increase in size are seemingly un an unavoidable side effect. So when I do vile blood and pure blood at the same time, that's what created these crystals, okay? I hear some... Things moving through the blood. Okay. Really low on healing though, so I hope I can find a beacon real soon. Okay, so there's a soldier here. You will help me out with my healing quest. Oh, oh now it did work with the shield, okay. Whatever. Probably because they were blocking on time last time, so... Is this... Is, I can't target you. Are you sentient? Huh, hello. That's the first. Emerald. This is Emerald. Ah. Corvus, do you remember me? Probably not. I'm Emerald. I also have a little credit for your presence in this world. You have unlimited potential. Maybe we should see this conversation as an opportunity. Corvus, do you have something you want to ask? Uh, yeah, but I guess I could show an item. Uh, yeah, I want you to, uh, to ask you about this experimentation. The transformed are so interesting and are such challenging research material. Using the infected as carriers, we use alchemy to grant them new life. A very interesting concept, though interspecies fusion was required, and that was no easy task. The su successful cases were few and far between. Corvus, you were one of the lucky few. Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. Uh, yeah, show another item, the Odor's Vile Core. I cannot believe Odor's research has made such progress. He should not have been wasting his time on that sideshow act. If he came to study under me, he could probably become an even greater researcher than Aizumi. Okay. God of the Fool's file core. Magnificent! A masterpiece of masterpieces. Such complicated technology and for Odo to use it on such a massive structure, it's such a pity you destroyed it. I'm simply dying to know how Odor managed to make a lifeless body move like that. Yes, for that probably we need to defeat Odor again. Okay, so you just give me lore, basically. This mysterious outfit of yours, okay? <coughs> Interesting. I really want to heal up. Last page of researcher's journal. I don't know what happened, there was a loud noise, and then a giant hole appeared in the roof of the central greenhouse. Amid the air piercing din Oh <laughs> no, no careful no reading for us. Okay. 
<clears throat> I do want to continue reading though, so I'll we'll get back here. Go to items. Uh, what is it now? Collections. Lore. Um, go all the way down, I guess. Store. Circus. The last page here. Amid the ear piercing din, the hanged queen appeared. Hanged queen, okay. Who ought to be locked up on the ground. Her body had grown more than three times in size since the last time I saw her. She began to massacre all the creatures and researchers on site. I don't dare to imagine what happened on the ground. Yeah, so she got fused with other creatures and pure blood and wild blood and everything together. And then started massacring everything and everyone. Makes uh, makes sense actually. Maybe you don't do uh, that shit, you know? Okay, so there's this side. And then as we drop down there, there's also this side. Uh, not a that does, does not seem to be working. So let's check here. Yes, I'm glad I went here. So there's two play two sites to look out for. Okay. I think that's also a good end again. So let me rest level up. Oh I can also increase potion perhaps. Um, I will increase this and go to plague weapon and increase this and the whip uh gain a stack of offensive buff and then two when a whip landed um this looks pretty good actually let's let's just try the whip it's a hundred no seventy five let's just try it instead of the side curious about it and level up I will continue with the plague just one okay and kind of a glass cannon build that I got going here um, I will the enemy counter attack gouge is reduced. Let's just do that. I feel like because they do counter attack me when I combo them. I think that will make that happen a little bit less often. Just Ooh, that's a long long reach as well. Okay. Very quick. I like that. And a short cooldown. Okay. So let's rest here once again, and um, I'll close up the video, that's the spirit of ASMA. As always, thank you for joining me on this journey, I'm really enjoying this game. Um, I'm glad I went to the Royal Garden, I'll go back to the uh, Sea of Trees later to defeat Odor once more. But for now, I wish you all a beautiful day, and peace.